When it comes to color grading in photography, you might just think there's two options, color and black and white. But there's actually a third option, monochromatic, where you can use a specific color to color grade your image. And today I'm gonna to be showing with you how you can create this effect in Photoshop. And I'm gonna start right now. Now, when anyone ever mentions monochrome, I guess you'll probably just think of black and white. But it doesn't mean that black is the only color you can create a monochromatic effect with. In fact, you can make a monochromatic effect with any color. So let me show you how we can create this effect in Photoshop. So go ahead and open up your chosen photo. And all we're gonna need is just sync two adjustment layers to create this effect. So what we'll do is firstly go down to our adjustment layers icon found in the bottom right hand corner. And we're gonna go ahead and select black and white first. This is probably the most important. We wanna convert it into black and white first. Now, Technically, this is what you call a monochromatic effect, when there's only a single color in that photo, but it doesn't mean it needs to just be black. Again, like I was saying, it could be any color. So let's go ahead and change that color. So once we've converted it into black and white, all you'll need to do is create an overlay color. So a way to do that is again, go down to our adjustment layers icon found in the bottom right hand corner. And this time we'd go ahead and choose solid color. Now solid color is what it says on the tin, we're creating a solid color. And we can choose any color of your choice. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose, uh, let's go ahead and choose like an orangey color. So I'm gonna go ahead and choose a color like so. But what we need to do is blend it with the background. So what we need to do is to convert it using the blending modes. So let's go to our blending mode options found on the top here. And what we're gonna do is drop all the way down to where you can see it says color. And what it will do is because of that black and white adjustment layer, it will convert all of those blacks into a certain hue, allowing you to create this monochromatic effect of any color of your choice. And again, what's great about this effect, because we've used a solid color adjustment layer, we can go ahead and change that color after the fact. So for instance, let's say we wanted to make it a little bit more red or a little bit more green, blue, uh, we can make it purple, any color of your choice. Now for this particular effect, I quite like this kind of dark orange. Now what we can do is move it around to get the best. You can make it a little bit more gray, a little bit more saturated, move it around until you are happy with the result. And once you're happy, all you need to do is click OK. And as you can see, we've gone from color to this really nice monochromatic effect. And what's great is you can choose any color of your choice. So go ahead and experiment to see what works for you. Again, here is the before and here is the after. And this particular effect worked for you. Make sure to write it down in the comments below.